Google's Notebook LM is designed to help us learn and research. In today's video, we are looking at how teachers, students, and other learners can use Notebook LM's new features in the learning and research. Go to notebooklm.google.com, click on create new, and then start adding your sources. To start with, go to your Google Drive, click on this, insert your sources go back add sources then go to youtube click on this bar over here insert your link click on insert as well now you've got three sources go back to add sources as well now this time around you'll add your click on listen notes to copy text insert your listen notes over here click on insert now let's try notebook lm's new feature the first one that you'll use is deep research put in your topic click on deep research click submit the new deep research feature allowed the notebook to come up with 37 sources of which the top 20 had been discovered as well so what i'll do here is i'll click on top 20 I'll go through the whole list and if I'm not happy with any of them I will try to untick them so this allows you to choose the sources that you'll need for example if I don't need that I'll untick that and then click on Import. summary has been generated here is my topic and then I'll save this to note as well so here you can see that it has been saved I'll go ahead and use the agent to create an, a better source of notes for my students. So I'll go back and put in a prompt, create lesson notes on the topic that would suit the A11 class. The objective of the unit is to explain what is climate change, what are the impacts of that, how it can be managed, include a case study, ex uh, explain short and long-term solutions and so on. So I'll go and put a prompt in there and click on submit now your notes are ready right let's head over to the studio to start with we we'll look at all the features over here the first one that we'll look at is audio overview so we'll click on that and then we'll click a video overview as well this will give you a a video of what this whole unit is about then mind map it allows you to break down the concepts you can download it as a P png file as well and then go ahead and click on report and you could create a study guide you could create a blog post as well so maybe i'll click on that and then i'll go ahead and click and flashcards as well i'll create a quiz and this helps me create an infographic which will be a poster that i can share with my class and then finally a side deck a powerpoint presentation so these are the two new features that have been introduced in Notebook LM. So now I've got my lesson notes. I've got my resources that I'll be using now for the whole. Your resources are ready. Let's click on the first one. The first one is a video overview. So click on the video. So there you go so that's your video that has been generated you can download that over here the next one is a powerpoint so based on your sources it has created a powerpoint so you can go ahead and click start the slideshow and the whole powerpoint will be displayed you can again download and share the next one is in audio so you can go ahead and click So there you go you can use it as an as a resource as well the next one is an infographic so there you go the whole um, set of nodes have been generated into a infographic a poster that you can share with your class again you can download and share as well and then go ahead the next one would be a climate change quiz based on your resource you keep on clicking on next 
and then it will show the question plus a sort of a hint as well for the students and then you go back and look at your flashcards so here again the notes are here and the answers are at the back so click on the next one and you keep going and then once that's ready flashcards a study guide that you generated it's here you can copy and paste into google docs and then create a set of study notes for them as well it comes with questions as well and then you have got your mind map which would look something like this and you can go ahead and click on these links which helps you to further look into details of your notes that you had generated now you can go ahead and look at your uh, notes that you gener generated to start with so these are all your sources that you have generated using notebook lms new features which are infographic and side deck and slide deck as well so there you go um, in this video what we did was we looked at how to create a notebook based on any topic that you are doing in your class we looked at how to include uh, we looked at how to in add sources then we looked at summary notes we looked at how to prompt using the agent and then we went all the way to the studio and then we created all these resources. do subscribe to support the channel see you in the next one